Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. This is Ibris Khan Ratin. In this video, you can see how we can use this kind of editor in our project and save the editor text, whatever it is bold or italic or font color is green or blue. In a word, whatever you type on this editor, in any style, we will save that text with exact style in our database and also retrieve it from database and display on our interface in this text area. So let's see how we can do it. Let's create our database. Open SQL Server, new database. Editor. Okay. I'm going to take a table ID, which is primary key and text size is max. Set primary key and make it auto increment editor table now open visual studio create an mvc project sp.net web application select mvc Okay, let's take a model class text editor This is the properties ID text Let's create a business logic. I'm gonna take another folder for business logic Class text editor BL so SQL connection okay here we have to write our database connection string view server explorer connect to database server name localhost text editor my database okay right click properties here is my connection string copy okay done i'm going to write my save method Table name is text editor table. When we save text editor text into database, we have to encode it first. That's why I write this here web utility dot HTML encode our text. I'm gonna write another method for get that text table name is i 
I will save one text in database and want to get that text. That's why I use top one. Let's create our text editor controller. Controller. In this action result, and I'm going to take an HTTP post for save method. Another for get method. Now, I'm going to use a free plugin for text editor, which we will find on Google. Let's open browser, type JQTC text editor download. Click on download button. Then extract files. I only need these three files one PNG, one CSS, and one JS file. Let's take another folder. Give name, say text editor contents at existing item okay at let's create our view so views add folder text editor checking a CSS HTML page index HTML spark no need this is my basic HTML where I take two text areas this one and this one one for saving our text and another is for see the output now we have to link the js css of this plugin so drag and drop and this is for jquery and our plugins JS script. Script type text JavaScript. Script. Document ready. I want to apply our plugin on this text area. So copy its ID dot and the plugin name is JQT E done. Now I am gonna take two Ajax call, one for save and another is for get our output. So for this button save, I am copy pasting this code. And for this get button, I'm gonna type this click event Ajax call. 
Now go to layout.cac HTML page. I no need this whole code. I make it simple. Done. And go to app start, route config, make it our controller name, text editor. So the basic task is done. Let's run our project. Okay, let's type something here. Hello world, welcome to um, I, our channel. Make it bold, channel, red color, make it italic, underline, click on save button, saved. Let's open our database, refresh. So this is our encoded value. Now I want to retrieve this data. So we have to decode it in our business logic class. So open project, go to business logic class. Here we can see we decode our retrieved data. Now, if I click on this get button, here we can see world is in italic form, welcome, underline, thumb, I care, bold, and red color applied on this channel word. So in this way, we can use editor in our project. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, then please like, comment, and share. And obviously subscribe my channel for new video tutorials. Thank you.